love the show. Bit of Thank a weird. Thank you, by the way. Thank it's you. It's so nice when you say that because honestly, mm. like, I don't know how to say this. Like, I obsess over like YouTube, like uh, stats and a bit on Reddit and all of that stuff. And um, but that's all the that's all the sort of contact that we have with any of you. I have no, we have no idea who's watching this. We know a couple yeah. of our friends are watching this, but that's pretty much it. So thank you so much when you take the time to say that you like the show. Yeah. Like it's huge for us. It, it really, really is. is. <laughs> okay, bit of a weird question. Is it okay to masturbate over someone's Instagram pictures? Yes! <laughs> Okay, so I obviously, oh, if they're over over the age of consent, yeah, obviously, yeah, I mean, obviously yeah. Jesus fucking yeah, Christ. That's, yeah. So, but that's me subjectively, completely. Look, I mean, I think it's absolutely ridiculous to think that people um, don't fan. Okay, let me rephrase this. It's like it doesn't have to be an Instagram picture. Any sort of content that is put out there, even words. Of course, people will like really, really desire that. If that's something that they're into and. Um, I find this really vanilla, actually. What just you can actually get off off just an Instagram picture? Like that's amazing to me. Yeah, right. It's like back it's in the day when people would like pass around a Playboy magazine yes! between their friends. So this is to me the cutest thing ever. But like the fact that it's just the one picture, it's not moving. But maybe they flick through a lot. I don't know. Maybe they. Don't yeah, know. yeah, yeah. I mean, also you have a lot of like um, like sex workers and porn people in on Instagram doing like very sexy Instagram stuff, and also like Absolutely. little jiggly videos and stuff. Also, like a lot of stuff is up subconscious. Like you know, so many people that like I've just seen, I haven't even thought that they're attractive, or like I just, and then I dream them, and I have like mm. really nice sexual dreams about them. Or some people that I do actually fancy, and then I have even more stupidly sexual dreams around them. Yeah, about I had a sexual them, right? dream about Marianne recently, and of another person who I know only vaguely in context, and it was very. But the, I, I'm actually. Thank you for even vocalized that now, but even in, in in the past, because I've like I've I've done this to you like that that sort of thing more than you've been like very like this to me, but like for the first time. Oh, that's because you don't you don't really <laughs> Not like physical contact though. You don't really like hugs and stuff. No, you don't. No, you don't. I say I do that. You don't. Do that. <laughs> We're having a lovers quarrel. <laughs> See, someone's that's gonna fat to that. No, I'm kidding. No, we don't assume that. We don't assume that. <laughs> Okay, so yeah. can, I give, can I give my take? Yeah, yeah, so uh, oh, you, no, just to finish it, it's just like a lot of the time desires are not, uh, you know, they, they come out of nowhere, it doesn't have to be an Instagram yeah. picture, it doesn't have to be any picture, and sometimes they're completely involuntary, and it is absolutely ridiculous to think that um, if you put some sort of image out there that someone is not thinking out there that that's like hot. Okay, so my take is actually still yes, but yes with potential ethical questions. Let's go. So the the definite yes is Insta celebs. Fine, like yeah, right, you know right, they've made right. a career out of being sexy on Instagram. That is their career. They put themselves out there. It's the same like if I if I jack off to I don't know, Kira Knightley and Pirates of the Caribbean. I mean not my type, but I couldn't think of any other women. <laughs> uh, then you know it's whatever. So early Winona Ryder. <laughs> um, yeah, that's like it's kind of like they have made a public persona. The way the way the place the place where I'm a bit more. Not sure of the ethics is people you know. Because in one of my groups recently, there was someone who was like, oh, I caught my boyfriend um, jacking off over the Facebook pictures of my friends. And I heard this somewhere. Yeah, I feel like it probably, probably happened more. A lot. Yeah. And it was like that thing of like, yes, you're putting your Facebook picture out there, but you're not putting, like, to what, okay, to what, I guess it's the question that like, I'm not sure of the answer. To what extent is like, Putting it out there, relinquishing your claim or your right to pri privacy. You know, I just don't, I just don't oh, know. Oh, no, of course. I mean that as well as I'm like, of course, like one shouldn't always assume that any sort of content we put out there, someone's going to touch themselves to. And yet, you know, there's that phrase, it's like, come up with anything you want. There's probably a, a part of it, it yeah. right? So that's how it is. It's like, you may think, I don't know, this is not a very good setup because we are kind of like, I guess, overtly sexualized or whatever more than we should be but like someone could just post a picture of a map and you can yeah. i can think of how someone would think that this is a vagina well and, and this is the question right the baltic sea of the vagina because like say like okay i'm like masturbating in bed and i'm masturbating thinking of a person i met at a party that thinks really hot that's not a lacking consent right that's just well yeah that's the thing it's the same thing it's the same thing and yet for some reason i feel like it's and it's yet, just, why? It's just that now we have access to pictures, right? So, like, that boyfriend 
so you know kind of saw the pictures and then touched themselves to that but um realistically it's like they they just are they just fancy your friends that's the it's thing not the right pictures, they it's, just fancy your yeah, friends that's the thing that's with them being like a shit boyfriend who should maybe like i don't know not do that no, but then, okay wait that. but okay yeah, yeah, yeah no exactly, i take it right? back i take it back no, yeah. As in, yeah like okay so what if it is a secret fantasy it's like they're absolutely an incredible boyfriend to you they fucking love you they look after you all of those things and yeah, they the touch thing. themselves to your friends we occasionally. We both think that it's it's possible to like fancy more than one person at once. So why be but that's the about thing. it? Honestly, like I think this is also again a bit subjective because we are like of po- of polyamorous context. So we abs- we can totally internalize. I don't know we, we 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 fundamentally understand how it is not infidelity when someone thinks of other people in but, sexual and ways. And yet, I have to be honest with myself, and maybe this is problematic or something. But I would be more upset if I caught my boyfriend masturbating over pictures of you than I would if I caught him masturbating over pictures of Kira Knightley. No, but it's because, I guess, I... But, 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 I'm, though I'm not, I'm more of a possibility than Kira Knightley, right? Though I'm not. But I don't think that's... I guess because if it's friends, if it's, like, known it's people... It's possible. It's like, why are they with me then? Am I just the fallback because they couldn't get ex friend? I feel like there's more, like, social dynamics come into play. But then, yeah, it's the same as your boyfriend saying that he fancies one of your friends. So it's like, yeah, yeah again, it's... Yeah, it's not the picture. Uh, to me, like the picture and stuff is yeah. kind of irrelevant. It's like they just, they just fancy someone else. Yeah. Or, or, but yeah. Again, I honestly, I, I have never. I don't think I've ever touched myself to a picture. It was either a video or nothing at all. Mm. Something yeah, about what I do in my head flat. is much, is much better than. Yeah, again, like, even in your head is video, right? Yeah, it's definitely video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not like well, not to say my head is video. Like it's probably more like gifs. <laughs> yeah, my as head as is a, gifs as well. Like, <laughs> Yeah, that bit, that bit, that bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. literally. <laughs> I'm repeating every open. Oh my god, that's so true. I'm yeah. running for my gifts in my head. Yeah. Yeah, literally. <laughs> so yeah, I guess I guess for me the, the the question is not so much about the picture, it's about the closeness. But even then I don't know where I stand because I think I think practically I stand with you. But I think not emotionally to say that it's super annoying. No, it's yeah. absolutely terrible. Emotionally I stand on the side of I can't really fucking do that and I would potentially even no, but not that's be with not that person. In the question though, like like I mean, no. as in like that that's the sort of situation you've had. I suppose you No, I've never had that, that situation. Group. No, but no, but have you you've read in that group as in like that's the, the yeah. about like all oh, my friends. Yeah, no, I think if someone if I found out that like unbeknownst to me, my partner actually fancies well, my friends, I'd be upset. I'd be super upset. I'd be like, okay, if I can just go for it. You know, that's yeah, right. Of yeah, hundred percent. Looking good to sleep with them already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, hundred yeah, percent. Yeah, that's exactly too. what I would be doing. But um, <laughs> but that's not the issue at hand. That's yeah. not the issue at the, hand. The ethics of Instagram per se. Like I said, we have images on our head. We have images on TV. Yeah. We fantasize about whoever we fucking fantasize. Yeah. Like, yeah. As long as it's you know. People are of consent of and all the time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Age of consent and like, um, yeah. I don't know. Are we are we on the right side of history right now? I feel like we have to be. I feel the like whole no economy is based on sex. Like, yeah. Jesus Christ! Like, there is a reason why the people that have the most Instagram followers are the ones that are posing the most stereotypically yeah. attractive. Like, and pictures. you know, obviously, don't contact them. Don't tell them oh, you're wanking over them. Don't make them in any way know that you're doing this because yeah. that's gross as fuck. But no. like, we can't control. Don't make your partners do it. No. Any of that. Like, no. Look, look. Literally, it's kind of similar to. Yeah, to like. Any sort of content out there, like whether that's video or that's porn, it's just something yeah. in between sometimes. I don't... But I just wonder, like, why would anyone say, like, no, it's not okay? I think because the person posting the images hasn't posted them for that purpose. Yes. And therefore it's... You're sexualizing someone without their consent. I guess that... I think that's the argument. Yeah, you're sexualizing someone without their consent. But we're consent. constantly sexualizing people without their we, consent. We are constantly sexualizing Should we people not be doing that? Should we only... Se- like, okay, in like... In the anarchist utopia or whatever... Sure. Do we see everyone as neutral until proven that they have consented to you viewing them sexually? Is that what we want? Like, you know, <laughs> like, theoretically. That's a... That's a traffic light party. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, we're hosting a traffic light party. Oh, by the way, at some yeah, point. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but you know what I mean? Like, like, should we? Are we actually trying to unlearn the fact that we're sexualizing people when we just meet them? Because I feel like that's a impossible, and b I don't know if that's I think my it's utopia. It's impossible, and I don't think that's my utopia either. Yeah. But maybe we're wrong. I don't know. If you think we're wrong, right? And I just, I think honestly, like, it's just the sort of reality I never even 
thought about mm. so this is why it's so difficult i think the thing that's problematic is acting on it like catcalling yeah, harassing people course, that's what's Jesus. problematic not having sexual thoughts yeah objectifying reducing them only to that thing and then letting them know that you've done that yeah bad, bad. Like, cheating yeah and or yeah like not okay also like uh, objectifying them in the in that sort of manner if they're your colleague and then for mm. instance they reject you and then you're not like hire like you're not hiring yeah. them or like you're not promoting them because you fucking fancy them though yeah. they said no to you and then you like fucking are, are like somehow i don't know, insulted by that mm. so that person has no future in your company or whatnot like shitty behavior mm -hmm. go do one like oh yeah. but yeah jacky off because you find someone's picture hot i mean if that works for you i'm kind of jealous I yeah yeah 100 percent. like just the still image for me that's like, uh, tricky tricky yeah. tricky yeah 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 really yeah. tricky yeah I can't, don't think, don't think I can do it. I mean, again, it shows how, like, spoiled, I guess, we are now. Because I, I have this amazing book of, like, it's a, a photographic album of Victorian porn, which mm. is just still images. And honestly, I think it's because I can tell just how... To me, it's way sexier than any of, like, today's Instagram bullshit, oh, yeah. right? Because I, I can tell just how much love and desire has been put into those pictures and just how like the i think the whole atmosphere about building it and just how important mm. that picture it is for someone and they're very graphic in that yeah like that's me so no victorian porn's great oh like i have this book by annie Ooh. nin which is um she's an erotica writer mm -hmm. and she uh it was like 1920s or 30s i think around that time and she um wrote these like beautiful erotic stories and they were illustrated with these images of women on couches and stuff yes. and they were just fucking beautiful oh. like yeah and also, like, and again, they were like, oh, it was ridiculous, right? A lot of them, so, well, you know, I guess, plumper than right yeah. now. They and have bushes. Oh, totally have bushes. And, and again, yeah, it's so arousing. Like, okay, for me, one of the sexiest things is like suspenders and a garter belt and then like a full bush. Because Ooh. I'm just like, it's like the hidden, it's like the same reason suspenders are sexy, right? Is that like, I'm wearing suspenders, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> is that like, it's the hiddenness of it and yet it's exposed. See, that's the thing, if I have my bra, you should have your suspenders, man. Because for me, it's the boobs and for you, it's the yeah, legs, right? Yeah, but I've got the one right? inside out because I wasn't paying attention, so it's a little bit, um, oh, God, you know, you can see the seams, which is not the point. No, but I guess that's... Oh, look, I gave him a flash. <laughs> <laughs> sue us. <laughs> <laughs> don't sue us. Oh, don't sue us. Yeah, okay, I think we're... Yeah, yeah but no, but this is just the sort of finally mm. kind of like... I th yeah, it's kind of fascinating for me to think that, yeah, that sort of stuff turns us both on. To me, it was mm. like flowers around like naked mm. people. And that's just, oh. and I guess black and white, you can't yeah. even tell, you know, but it's just like that. I could, uh, that's probably those are the yeah. images I could probably go there. I mean, uh, I used to I don't think I would just like name, look at it and then like, that's what I'm saying. I would still have to like close my eyes and imagine like a gift. Well, that's, why, <laughs> that's why this book was so good because it was like the erotic stories and then the uh, images so I could like think of the story and look right, at the image yeah, and right, I had right, the whole right. like, mm. it was so great. There's some of like women and cats that were really good. I'm, I'm not a furry, but it was really good. Yeah. Be like a naked woman on a couch with her cat sitting there really stately. Honestly, today's erotica is boring as fuck. It's, I've been going on like um, erotica lit or whatever it's called, lit erotica. It's fucking shit. I got more on my Harry Potter fanfic than I do on that website. It's yeah. balls. Yeah, we literally have Instagram models, anime. Mm. If anyone wants to recommend some good erotica, please do, because I'm gasping out here. <gasps> that was my gasp. All right, let's go. All right, it's your turn, right? Did I see? No, did I have Oh, yeah, did you have anything? Yeah, no, I literally just have yes! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. 